This is going to be a quick review of the Coastal Pet Nickel Cowbell with Nylon Strap. Now, I'll be really honest, I bought some uh, bells online here with a strap attached and the bells were so cheap that I asked for a refund and returned the thing. That's how bad they were. So I went out and I bought these Coastal Pet, made by Remington, nickel-plated cowbell. I bought one in a small, one in a large, and I think you can get a two-pack, uh, two-pack large also. So let me take this out of the package now and see what I bought. Okay, now I can tell you already I'm happy. Um, these are used mostly for dog training, but you can use them for whatever you want. You could put this in a cage with birds. You could just use it as a bell to, uh, for a dinner table. These are really neat. I, as I said, the others that I bought, I was so disappointed with the other company. And this has a nice loud sound that I'm going to hear when the dog rings it. The other one, it was on a strap. The dog, I, I literally would hit my foot on the strap and it didn't make a sound. So this, I like the smaller one better, I'll be very honest with you right now. It requires next to no movement and it rings. The larger one has a, a louder sound, but it also requires, as you can see, it requires a lot more movement. And for dog training, that's gonna probably be really difficult to use. So large, if you're doing for dog training, if you got a big dog, then this might be good. But honestly, the small barely requires any movement. And that's how you train your dog to let you know when you need to go to the bathroom. Very good quality bells either way. I'm not, nothing wrong with this bell just for dog training. As you can see, it requires a lot more movement um, to activate it, probably because of the weight of the clapper. And with the smaller bell, really nice, very nice. So I'm going to show you how you use this thing. I should have this on a tripod, but let's see how the dog reacts. It's kind of loud, so it's kind of... Touch. 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 And that's how you train a dog. True to her, it's a loud, high-pitched sound, so she's kind of scared, which is normal for a dog. It takes them a while to get used to the sound of it. And what you do is you take this on a doorknob, you hang it from a doorknob, or you hang it from some place with a string or something that it's not going to hurt the, the pet and they won't end up uh, getting caught on it. But you hang it from a door and f what you do first is you train the dog how to touch. You, go, you put this by their nose and you say touch. And you train them to touch. And I'm going to show you how you do that. Oh, well, she's kind of nervous, but let's see. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Touch. That's how you do it. Touch. And you train the dog touch. Touch. And then after they can do that, step is trying to train them to touch it. Touch. And there you go. Touch. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Good girl. Touch. 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 And when they do that, you reward them. And you keep rewarding them. And they get used to learning how to touch with the finger, then they learn how to touch with the bell. I just took this out of the package. Check this out. Touch. Good girl. Good girl. So what you want to do is reward them when they do that. And after it gets to the point, oh, she's trying to eat the camera now. After you get to that point where they know what they're doing with the touching with the finger and the touching with the bell and they're not scared of the sound, then you're going to put it on the door. And believe me, this, the, as I said, the big bell, you're not going to probably not have as much success because it requires a lot of effort to ring for a dog, especially for a little dog. Big dog, maybe not. You'll hang this from the door some way you might put a screw in there or a nail or a string or a strap and hang it from the doorknob and when the dog needs to go every time you go out of, uh, to take a walk ring the bell and the dog is going to start to learn over time that the bell means they're going out the door to go to the bathroom and soon the dog should be able to do this on their own it might take you a couple weeks a couple months it might take you a year dogs will learn dogs are not stupid dogs are very smart it's the trainer that might not be so smart. So work with the dog, take your time, feed them the treats and the good treats. And this is an incredibly awesome bell. I'm very happy with it. I'm happy with both of them, but the small bell is the one that I'm going to use for the training. It's not going to frighten her and she loves the sound of it. And it's very easy, requires next to no movement to ring. If my videos help you out, please do a thumbs up, a subscribe, a like. If you want to share this on any website, that would be awesome. 
you want me to do a review of anything, let me know. If I can get a hold of the product, I will review it. And link this to any website. That would definitely help out my channel. Thank you. And good luck with the training of the dog. Remember, the dog will learn after you learn how to train them.